Hi, everybody. I'm Chip Elliott. Um, I'm going to go through this very quickly. This is the, uh, the visioning exercise that uh, Jim Carosi just, just mentioned. So I'm not sure if people can actually see the bottoms of the slides here. You know, my apologies. But so, so we have been looking beyond the internet, and hopefully after that we will start acting beyond the internet. Um, that's, that's one of the main goals of this group. But, but our idea is basically now is the time to make concrete plans for exploring emerging planetary scale internet things beyond the internet. Right? At this point, we can now start to see what things are going to look like beyond the internet. So let's formulate how are we going to do research in this space, what are we going to need, and so on. So uh, last fall, uh, we set up a quick steering group to help organize these visioning activities, organized three workshops, and are in the course of drawing up a planning document uh, to give ideas uh, to size and to Jim. Who, you might wonder, I hope many people know at least one person on this list that you can ask, you know, what's going on, what, what is all this stuff? Uh, but it's a mix of, you know, pretty well-known and well-respected uh, researchers, people who create and operate um, research infrastructure, and campus CIOs, because they will play an important role. Okay, here's highlights of the three workshops. Um, actually, at this point, you know, two of the workshop reports are online, so at the end I'll point you to them. So these are, these are just highlights. But each one had about 50 or 60 people in it, mostly researchers, but a few other you know, non-researchers as well. Applications and services. The big picture is there is a data deluge coming. It's things like you know, cars with real-time LiDAR sensing that can be fed over wireless into, you know, into data. You just get 3D millimeter accurate sensing of everything all the time, right? Huge data deluges are kind of, it's not just thermostats, right? Immense amounts of stuff is coming our way. There's obviously major privacy and security issues. Um, as a group, this uh, workshop saw a lot of innovation at the edge coming, right? Edge is very important in this. And the idea of having living labs where you can get, for example, campuses and students to live in these kind of futures will be really, really handy. Okay, the software-defined infrastructure, software-defined exchanges, SDI, SDX workshop was extremely lively. Uh, no, no surprise to anyone who's active in this space. Uh, but I think everybody believes, yes, this, this really is the real deal. Um, Software-defined infrastructure is coming. Genie is an early version of that, um, where p it will be sliced, virtualized, and so on. And in fact, even today's internet is already beginning to undergo a very deep transformation in this space, uh, as has uh, the United States cyber infrastructure, the, the stuff used for science and technology research. So looking forward, uh, this, this workshop envisioned a world in which all aspects of the planet cyber infrastructure are interconnected, multi-tenant, we would say sliced in the genie world, and deeply programmable as a planetary ensemble. Right? So that's kind of where we think the world is going to be in seven, ten years, you know, that kind of time frame. And I think it should be apparent there's a lot of research challenges that arise in this space. The third, the third workshop was on future wireless cities. Uh, and basically what, what people see, you know, these are my words, but we're moving from things like cellular systems and Wi-Fi to kind of these city scale clouds that have radios all through them, right? So the cloud kind of technology or the genie kind of technology is going to become pervasive in all these next generation systems. This is obviously an area of a lot of economic importance. And for the first time I can recall, we have cities that are interested in participating. We have spectrum we can use. We have the kind of technologies that we can roll out through this. It's unbelievable, right? So, so this is a fantastic time to try to do community scale experimentation uh, in the wireless space. 
Okay, uh, this kind of long thing way up at the top is my first attempt at a, at a WordPress uh, page. If you go there, looking beyond the internet, and then I didn't know how to get the word blog out of there, so looking beyond the internet blog.wordpress.com, uh, two of the three workshop reports are already up there, as are the background on those all three workshops. Very soon, the third workshop will be part up, but <clears throat> will be up there. And in about two to three weeks, uh, the steering group's you know, overall report will be there as well. So that's it. Um, we're a little crowded for time, so just hunt me down and find me if you have questions uh, when we get to the next break. Thank you very much.